Good morning, y'all. This morning, Bumblebee says, Evil woman, doo -doo 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 -doo. evil woman, you're an evil woman. I was like, hey, now, I, I really, I don't think I am. <laughs> Curiously enough, Duran Duran just put out a cover of this song three days ago. Oh, really? You don't say. Bumblebee, I tell you. Usually on point. This time, just a wee late, but still, like three days off. Not surprising, right? The song originally from Electric Light Orchestra came out on Halloween in 1975. It does have a line in the song. I just listened to it again, right? And it said, there's a hole in my head where the rain comes in. And it was just, what, a week or so ago that I was singing in another video, fixing a hole where the rain gets in, stops my mind from wandering. Very interesting. Th that's a weird synchronicity. And there are a bunch of others that fell out of this as well. So let's take a look. First up here, I have several different languages, the word for Saturday, right? And you'll note I have underlined in Russian, it's Subota, and it has the double B, right? So a double B looks like a 66, and it also looks like a capital G, G, right? Okay. So we have Duran Duran, and if you go back another 49 years from 1975, you come to 1926, wherein I found two curious news headlines involving women with the last name of Gibson. Really? So of course I took a little peek to find out what this, what this was all about. The first story of the year involving a woman named Gibson, her name was Violet Gibson. And on the 7th of April, she attempted to get rid of Benito Mussolini. Wow! She blam blammed him twice, but one of the shots misfired. Accounts vary if it was the first or the second shot. But the other shot grazed his nose. Oh, really? Hmm. Because this year, earlier this year, there was another big political figure who had a grazing of another sort in the ear. Nose and ear. Now, these are holes in your head. <laughs> if we're fixing a hole in the head, or if we're making another hole in the head? I don't know. <laughs> like I said, I'm not exactly sure what to make of the, all this. It's just the song popped into my head and I was waiting for the laundry to get done. So I figured I'll just find out what happened in 1926. <laughs> so Violet Gibson, right? She tried to off Benito Mussolini. And later in the year, there was a scandal in a church. The preacher was having an affair with one of the congregation members. She might have been in the choir. I'm not sure. But they were both married to other people. And they ended up found dead next to a cornfield. With love letters torn up and, like, both of their feet pointing towards a crabapple tree, and I don't know, there was a curious number of details involving this, this scandal. Anywho, a, an innocent man was arrested for the murders, and that, that's when Jane Gibson, so there's Jane coming up again, she was known as the Pig Woman. The pig woman, well, you know what's notable about a pig's face? The ears and the nose. And she lived on a farm. She was the owner of the cornfields and probably some pigs, I'm guessing. Right? So she was 
keeping the whole thing under wraps to herself what she had seen that night until she noticed that an innocent man had been arrested, at which point she felt the need to come forward with what she had seen that night, and it exonerated the innocent man and pointed to the actual guilty parties. I did not read the whole wiki to find out who those people were, possibly the actual spouses of the two found dead next to the cornfield. I'm not sure. But anywho. Another thing from 1926 was this movie, Flesh and the Devil. There was a love triangle and a duel between childhood friends. Those were some notable things that I pulled from the plot. Flesh and the Devil starring Greta Garbo. Another GG. Interesting. 77 GG. Subota BB. Kind of looks like a capital GG. That would be 22. Like, bam, bam. Two shots. Two power outages on the dolly before it hit the bridge in Baltimore. Baltimore Bridge. BB. Yeah. Baltimore. You know, I was also thinking about that the other day. There was Baltimore incident, and then there was an incident at the Biltmore estate. In between that, the Pope went to visit East Timor. Baltimore. Timor, Balt Baltimore, Timor, Biltmore. Those are not, they were not the same distance apart. But I did note that language thing the other night. Sorry, that's a separate thing altogether. It just popped into my head, figured I'd mention. So the last thing I have on here is the black butterfly that circled my deck the other day. I just saw another one this morning. The first one seemed to have a bit of a red tinge to it, like it had red markings, but it was in flight, so I couldn't tell like how much didn't seem like very much, just very slight red. Well, this morning, the wings seemed almost like they were so dark blue and shiny that they, they came across as black. It might have been a very dark blue, but not red, right? Like a, a different species of black butterfly altogether, but black nonetheless. Approximately 34 hours after the other one that I saw on the 10th. So I put it out another 34 hours, which brought me to tomorrow evening, tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. I don't know if that's related or not, but the BB and the red and the blue, you know, with the two asses in a nation attempt here and the ear and the nose, and fixing holes. Actually, this song just says, there's a hole in my head where the rain gets in. The other day I was singing the Beatles song, fixing a hole where the rain gets in. Stops my mind from wandering, right? Yeah, curious stuff. Hope you enjoyed this. Thanks a lot, y'all. Have a great day.